Alright, so we have an update today uh, to the game. And this update basically brought about the augment changes that were talked about in a workshop, a dev workshop. I didn't actually make a video about that um, because it was just long and it was just a lot of stuff to cover and I didn't really want to cover it. So, uh, instead what we're going to look at real quick is just two changes from this particular um, set of changes, which is Obviously, a change to mag. We're always going to have to talk about any changes to mag. Uh, so, the magnetized discharge augment has now received a passive, which is a 45% magnetized range. So, that just means that magnetized itself is now going to be a bigger bubble, about 45% bigger. And I believe that's a 45% base change, as opposed to 45% times whatever. Uh, so, basically, how big is it now? This big. So, if we were to, uh, you know, do our normal thing, get rid of all of that armor. Our bubble is like bigger. Honestly, I don't think it's noticeably bigger. Maybe it's just because I'm already using 45% range. So I think the premise is if I were to take out stretch on my build, then if you were to compare this bubble to any other bubble from any of my other videos, then it should be just as big. Uh, so. Yeah, it actually looks just as big. So that seems to be the real difference right there. That's where it becomes really noticeable. But if I am using Stretch, honestly, it doesn't seem all that noticeable to me. That's just me, though. But then again, like, you know, it's still a range buff, so that's always, um, that's always welcome. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Alright, let's get Stretch back on. And the other difference is... Well, first off, we also have this. This is our new loadout screen, so it's nice and cool. You can actually um, set it to name if you want to have an easier time finding your loadouts. So that's really, really good. Or a harder time, depending on what you're used to. If you're used to loadouts being one after another, then stick to that. Otherwise, I reckon going by name is always a good idea. Uh, oh, have I, have I actually got the have I actually got the thing on it? Okay. Uh, where's Smite Infusion? It's just a change to all of the augments that have this kind of ability where you get to add 100% uh, or based on power strength, radiation damage or if you're Saren it's corrosive damage, if you're Frost it's cold damage, etc. etc. So instead of having to aim at your ally, for example your Kubro, which you can actually use, uh, you can actually apply this too. Instead of having to aim and then hit one, you don't have to do that anymore, you just hold one. And that's it. So basically get all of your friends with you um, in Eidolon Hunts for example, and then hold one. And there you go. Now you have, in my case, 199 apparently percent extra radiation damage. Great! And that's how Smite Infusion, Venom Dose, all that jazz works. So let me know what you think about all of this in the comments below. Otherwise, if you like this video, hit that like button, subscribe for more Warframe content, and until next time, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye.